from our White House correspondent Ed Henry, the legislation unveiled tonight by your boss will be asking for $400 billion in spending. It will be offset with cuts in spending, but the president will not reveal what those cuts are tonight. Instead, he's going to give another speech down the road. What can you tell us? Well, look, first of all, uh, Ed, who's a terrific reporter, I think that's, uh, I'm not going to confirm that number. I think it's more of a guess than, uh, uh, than a, a dead on uh, price tag. What is important, and you forgot to note, is everything the president will propose tonight in the American Jobs Act will be paid for. Uh, and uh, the American people expect that, and they will demand it of Congress. Uh, they will also demand that Congress take action right now to help the economy and create jobs. And that's what the president is proposing. Every idea in this plan, in this piece of legislation that we will drop next week in Congress, uh, is something that has had traditionally bipartisan support. Uh, and so we're hoping that after their four to five week recess, members of Congress will come back having heard from their constituents, the same thing that the president heard from Americans when he was in the Midwest a few weeks ago, that they're fed up with Washington in action. They want Democrats and Republicans to come together around sensible solutions to get the economy right. growing and creating jobs.